Before getting into the video, subscribe the channel and press the bell icon to get notified every time we upload a video. In Python, just like list tuples, sets, we have another built-in data type which is dictionaries. So dictionaries are used to store data values in key value pairs. A dictionary is a collection which is ordered, changeable and does not allow duplicates. Dictionaries are written with curly brackets and have keys and values. Now, since they are ordered, changeable and not duplicate, dictionary items are present in key value pairs and can be referred by using the key name. Let us know how we create dictionary. So, dictionary is created by using curly braces and in the form of key value pairs. So, we define this dict as a dictionary which is equal to open a curly bracket. After that, write key. So, suppose we take the key brand, we write it in quotes, then after that, colon which is used to separate key from the value and then the value of brand is Ford then this also inside double quotes after that put a comma in order to separate the element that is we have next key value pair as say model enclosed in quotes then after that put a colon so model is key here and mustang will be value so mustang again in double quotes after that put a comma and then ear that ear in quotes and after that put a colon after that right 1964 and close curly brackets let us print this dict so print this dict and let us run this and see what is the output the output is brand Ford model Mustang and year 1964. This is how a dictionary gets printed. Now how can we access dictionary items? In order to access dictionary items, you have to write the key value. Firstly, in sets or, or list or in tuples, what we used to do is inside the square brackets we used to write the index number but instead of that we will write the key inside the square brackets so in this case let us say we have to print the value of fold so we will write the key brand here we write print this text and inside the square bracket write brand in double quotes obviously and then run this so here the output we get fold similarly you can do the same for year or model so in order to access a particular value you have to write the key associated with it now next is duplicates are not allowed suppose we write another key in the same dictionary we have year as the key and write a colon and write 2020 so when we run this we are getting 2020 as the year and not 1964 this is because it will allow only one key at a time and not allow duplicates that is firstly we had this year 1964 and it was overwritten by the year 2020 so the compiler will consider the recent one that is 2021 now in order to find the length of the dictionary we again use the length function say print len then inside the brackets we write this text and we run this so we have three here after that what are the data types or what is the data type associated with dictionary in order to find that we write print type of this dict on running this program we get the output as class dict which means it is of the type dictionary now we can also add a list as a value and 
which is associated with a particular key so if we have fourth key as colors and we give the value as a list which is red white blue which is enclosed in square brackets okay do not forget to separate these with a colon so this is colors is the key and this list is the value of this key and when we print this dict we are getting output as bran four and all these things and we are getting the list as it is there is another method to access the values or the elements inside a dictionary it is called the method get how is this used you simply write x equal to this dict dot get and inside it specify the key name so suppose we wish to print the value of the key model so we'll write this dict dot get and inside get we write model and now print x let us see on running this we are getting mustang as the output so this is how get method is used to access items after that we have keys method keys method will return a list of all the keys in dictionary so if we write x is equals to this dict dot keys and after that put these braces and then print x so it will give us the value dict keys and inside it brand model this year so basically these are the keys that are present in the dictionary this dict after that we can also add or append dictionary previously we were having three keys now we can simply use the key name and specify the value so suppose in this case if we write x equal to this dict dot keys and after that print x in order to see what all keys are present after that for adding we write first the name of the dictionary which is this dict and using the square brackets specify what key you want to add in so we wish to add the color key we'll write color and we have to write its value so close square bracket which is equal to white this must be inside double quotes and after that print x see the output the output previously for keys was dict brand model air and in the next line we have the changed values that is brand model ear color so that is how we can append dictionaries if you like this video hit the like button thank you